The volume of a pyramid is one-third the volume of a prism, with the same base area, or capital B, and the height, h. What would be the formula for the volume of a pyramid? Well, the volume formula is going to be one-third times the area of the base times the height. Now, sometimes you will end up having pyramids with different base styles. So if we had a rectangular base pyramid, its volume would be calculated by taking one third, the area of the base is length times width, and we have the height. Well, since in multiplication, it doesn't matter what order you multiply numbers, we can remove those parentheses, and that will make the formula one third length times width times height. If it was a triangular pyramid, its volume would still be one third times the area of the base, which would be one half the base of the triangle times the height of the triangle. And then you would multiply that by the height of the pyramid. Please note that these two height values are not going to be the same. Let's take a look at some examples to see how this is the case. Let's try an example. Find the volume of the square pyramid shown below. So we have our square pyramid. It tells us our height is five meters. And our side length for every side of the base in the square pyramid is eight meters. So the side length is eight meters. So then the area of our base is going to be 8 times 8, or 64 square meters. And now we can substitute these values into our formula. The volume formula is 1 third times the area of the base times the height. So we know we have 1 third, the base area is 64, and the height is 5. So we'll have one third of 320. And when we take a third of 120, we get 106 and two thirds cubic meters. And this slide shows how to calculate the volume of this square base pyramid. And we do end up getting the same result of 106 and two-thirds cubic meters.